is Power 102. Empowering you. Sexplosion is on Power 102. And now on new days and at new times. The country's most informative sex education program, Sexplosion, is on every Thursday from 7 to 9 p.m. And Fridays from 9 p.m. to midnight with Dr. Raj Ramnanan, the guru of sex in the Caribbean. A lot of times we think that sex is totally below the waist. It is not below the waist. It starts in the brain. The largest sex organ that you possess is your brain. Tune in for discussion on all sexual matters. Sexplosion on Power 102. In Power you. Well, thank you for staying here with us on Power 2.1 FM on a very special nighttime greetings to you. Special thanks as always to my daddy kicking off our afternoon into evening programming here on Power 2 FM. Also, a very special thanks as always to Skippy and Richard Norrie for the afternoon power drive. And we do welcome you to Sex Pleasure on Power 2.1 FM with the only sex doctor in the Caribbean, Dr. Raj Ramnanan. Total Imaging, the Adult Therapy Center, which is located at St. Augustine, and a very special nighttime greetings to you, my brother. How are you? Pleasant good evening. It's nice to see you. Yes, pleasant good evening to all the viewers out there, the listeners to Power 102. For those of you who are taking in the program, this is an abridged version of Sex Explosion. Normally, Sex Explosion on a Thursday night is from 7 till 9. Tonight, we're going from 7 till 8. Because we have a live broadcast of a karaoke. For those of you who can sing, you can join the bandwagon. Well, I hear you going next week to sing as a mother. Well, of course, uh, you and I. Yeah. But um, the kind of tune you want to sing, I don't think they allow that. You know. mm -hmm. no. They wouldn't be allowing those kind of. Um, yeah, yeah, they don't want to hear them kind of thing. So what hear some. So time well, you put on weight. <laughs> <laughs> Before Skippy left, yeah. he asked an important question. And uh, I mean, in a jovial way, but it was an important question about men who have issues with not ejaculating with their partner or not getting that satisfaction. Because there are some women who complain that their man go on too long. Uh -huh. This is this as there's a problem with premature ejaculation. The guys who ejaculate very quickly and they cannot satisfy their partner. There are those that go, go on and on and on, and their partner, although, be, although getting the satisfaction, let's say, in the first 20 minutes, mm -hmm. they have to keep up with the man. And sometimes they get very sore, sometimes they get pain, sometimes they just get bored, sometimes they just want it over with, and the guy is just going on. Now, if it's going on, and you have that level of excitement with your, the, the things that you're saying and, and the way you interact with your partner, that's different, because what you're doing there is that you're creating the atmosphere to go further. And by going further, whether it be penetration, oral, digital penetration, whatever it may be, you're creating a level of excitement. With that level of excitement, the person is going to reciprocate and you're going to get that person to start being part of whatever you're doing and enjoying it to the maximum. If she, is not, she or he is not enjoying it to the maximum, and of course, this applies to people who are in a homosexual relationship also. If the person is not enjoying it to the maximum, they are not going to give you what you need to ejaculate. And that's a very serious thing to, to, to understand. Lots of time, we don't contribute to our partner's well-being or sexual being. We just believe that if I lie there and I take whatever he's giving, that's good enough. I don't need to, to be part of it. I don't need to say anything. I don't need to make a sound. I don't need to, to, um, to, to touch, him, touch him, kiss him or anything. Just let him get it over with. Now, if he's going longer than normal, if he's going longer than normal, what happens? You may think that 
why is he going so long? I'm in pain. I'm getting dry. I'm not properly lubricated. I'm not turned on as I was before the orgasm. All these things may be going through your mind so you may not enjoy the intercourse as much as you had enjoyed it prior to getting your orgasm or achieving your orgasm. So if you don't play a part in stimulating the mind of the individual, because again, what triggers the orgasm or the, 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 well, what we call breaking, what triggers that in a man is what stimulates him. If the act, the physical act of penetrating does not stimulate him enough to ejaculate, do you think he's going to ejaculate? Mm -hmm. And the answer is no, because there's some persons who, while having sex, they feel numb. This is, is um, erected. They're going in and out, and they feel numb. So no matter what happened in there, they're just, they're just going until, until they run out of energy. But if you say the right thing, touch the right places, get into the mind of the individual, they will ejaculate eventually. So you have to take that into consideration and understand that. Mm -hmm. Now, tonight's program, as I said, is on a bridge version, so we have a, a very short time to talk about all the things we usually talk about. But it's important that we take our break, commercial break, and then we get back mm -hmm. to whatever topic persons may have out there. And for those of you who want to send your text messages, go ahead and do so. Mm -hmm. We're just to remind you that you are on the Internet at allsexpersonal.com on 2.1 FM. The only sex town in the Sunday Caribbean, Dr. Raj Ramanan of Total Image and the Adult Therapy Center, which is located at St. Augustine. We're just to remind you at home, at work, and in your community, think twice, think clean, go green. When you have the choice, take the pasta in the box instead of the plastic bag. You can also choose the product. Packaging. Try the farmer's market for your produce, fresh fruits and vegetables, as they are more likely to be light on the packaging. So before you use things once without thought, reuse, think twice, for a cleaner, greener Trinidad and Tobago. Powered by Suncor, the Trinidad and Tobago Solid Waste Management Company Limited, Power 102 and Boom 94. In association with Salmon Enterprises, they find first supermarket, Trinidad and Tobago Police Credit Union, with Martin PT, and the Gillette Group <coughs> of Companies. So remember folks at home, at work, and in your community, think twice, think clean, and go green. Keep calm in order to heal. Power 102, in collaboration with the NCRSA, presents The Calm Project. A 30-week series dealing with children and adolescents living with mental illness. Calm. Every Tuesday at 2 p.m. with our featured speakers, Dr. Asher Pemberton, consultant in pediatrics and adolescent health, and Ms. Renee Pilgrim, trust the manager at the NCRHA, The Calm Project. A part of Healthy Living with Stanley Augustus, sponsored by Guardian Life of the Caribbean and the Office of the Prime Minister, only on Power 102, empowering you. The Calm Project. Redemption. Read, read, read it up. Redemption. Redemption Six the concert. Saturday, June first, Queens Park, Savannah. Follow the music. Maxi Priest. Maxi Priest. What up, Trinidad? This is your man, Maxi Priest, and don't forget, I will be at Redemption Six. Saturday, June the 1st. Redemption. So get ready to rock with me. Redemption consists of Barry Wayne Mann and Mr. Barry Sound. Barry's Hammond Live. Redemption. It's a reggae concert the entire country anticipates. Trinidad, Trinidad, Trinidad. Taurus Riley. Taurus Riley Live on the day. Live with his whole band. Redemption 6 with Romaine Virgo. Christopher Martin. And Half Pint. General admission tickets are 300 Special reserve $500. And platinum deck $1,000. Limited backstage tickets available at $400. Get them now at NLCB Lotto Outlet Nationwide. All cache outlets. Bobby's Bar, Kubra. Cleves, Frederick Street. Rennie's High Street, San Fernando. Larry's, Chaguanas. In Access, Arima. And online at www.ticketfederation.com. Redemption 6. Re -re Representing free freedom. Love and life. Want to get your products and services out to more customers?
is how of getting more even to the store. The time need a boost of exposure. Their video editors are not harmful to it. You've been looking for. It is tailored to your needs and a team to create the ideal video ad. The choice is clear. R102, empowering you. So call us today at 62 Power. That's 627 6937. And ask to speak to a client advisor about your ideas and brand. We are Power 102, empowering you and your business today. Social issues, both local and international. Our economy has turned around. Yes, and Bina. The government says the economy is on the rebound, but some business and professional leaders say there's no visible trickle down. In a Power 102 poll, a majority of respondents said they don't anticipate any improvement in their quality of life. Next, we focus the state of the economy in light of the midterm budget review. Do you believe the true bend to beggar economy has turned the corner? People are investing and they're spending money in this country. Credit has increased by seven billion dollars over the last three years. Has there been discernible growth for small businesses? How many jobs have been created? How many jobs have been lost? These are some of the questions we will be addressing when we go in focus. The state of the economy and its impact on our society in light of the midterm budget review. When you come on celebrity athletics, analysts, judges of commerce. And take your calls on this ever engaging discussion. No, how many? Focus Any this program? Wednesday on the Power 102. What? Power With all these ads? that nobody does better at what we do best when it comes to tax education right here on Power 102.4 FM 6 on a digital command command and we are talk our image and data digital data center where he will treat all sectors and functions of both male and female. Uh, you can open up our lines as well? Yes, of course we can open up our lines and uh, make no apologies for the long ads because it's what pays the bill. That's correct. So yes. the more ads we have, the better it is. Better. But we're here to talk sex, and we're here to talk about things that you all want to know about. So you can text in, you can call in. Um, Junior will give you the number. But you can also send me messages on my personal cell, 7401961. That number again, 7401961. And for those of you who don't know, of course, we deal with all the issues at the Adult Therapy Center in St. Augustine. We deal with everything concerning the sexual dysfunction, premature ejaculation, penis enhancement for women who have difficulties achieving an orgasm, polycystic ovarian syndrome, polycystic ovaries, endometriosis, inability to be turned on, whatever it may be, we treat it at the Adult Therapy Center. And of course, we do deal with couples. We have couples um, consultation taking place also. So anything you want done, we do it at the Adult Therapy Center in St. Augustine, but we also have a branch in Debe Pinal, Debe, on the um, SS Erin Road. Mm -hmm. So for those of you who want to visit the Pinal, Debe area, for those of you who live in that area, those of you who live close to that environs, you can make your appointment there. I'm there on a Tuesday from 1 o'clock. And I'm also in Princess Town on a um, Thursday, Tuesday from 10 to 12. 10 to 12. For now, for now, until, uh, until the client is up, choose a day and be there for a long period of time. But we have a few clients already in Princeton. Of course, we have a lot of clients in um, DB. Yeah. And that clientele is building as the days goes by. So for those of you who want to get to any one of the locations to visit, to find out more about your sexual health or to better yourself, just call 645-4543. There are persons there now manning the phones. You can call there. You can make your appointment. You can tell them which branch you want to go to and they'll take that information. So but that's what we try to do. But, but you, know, uh, you have established that apart from two services which don't have anything to do with the two outlets. Three outlets. No. Three outlets. Three outlets. Yeah. No. But the total you? image is the, my parent company and it's the company that handles everything. Mm -hmm. But the branches that we have outside is Dr. Raj Adult Boutique. I have branded it with my name for a reason. Many a times persons go to adult stores and they buy stuff and they think they're supporting me. Now, persons who listen to me freely for the last 19 years would like to support us in some way or the other. Whether it, it, it may be buying a pack of condoms or buying a, a, a doll, it doesn't matter what it is. They want to know that they're supporting Dr. Raj. 
And I said, hey, who are these shops that are all about the place? They would tell them, yes, this is Dr. Rao's shop. But there's nothing here indicating that it is my shop. There's nothing that shows that it is my business place. That is outside of Kutu Limit, Dr. Raj Adal Boutique. The Dr. Raj Adal Boutique, the, um, the first one that I did was at Bangu number three, what you call Grand Bazaar. But it's not in Grand Bazaar, it's after Grand Bazaar on the left hand side going back to the the access road going back to the area. It's called the Boulevard. Just after the country where you stop and you get all the things to eat, the first building on the corner is where we are. We're upstairs. Mm -hmm. So the signs are upstairs. The building is upstairs. Branding. And it is so piece of all the stores. So when you go there, you get an idea what the other stores look like. When you go to Debe, Debe is a much larger store. Debe is a bigger store. Apart from the store, we have the clinic, which is next door. So if you don't want to go to the store, because some people who are trying, they don't want to go to the store, they would like to just come to the clinic. The clinic is next door. All you have to do is just ask, and you can walk through the corridor in the building and come to my door, which is the clinic door, and that is on a Tuesday. In Princess Town, it's not as big as either one of those two stores, but it is compact and nice. It's a really nice store. I, I, as a matter of fact, it, it's kind of my favorite right now because it's new. Cozy it's cozy. It's, it's, uh, there's an office there. There's a massage parlor there, there. You can get everything there that we where that we deal with. Right? I know a lot of people are booking their massages and whatnot also. So we have all that done at the Princess Town location. There are others, other, other individuals who are speaking to me about other franchises and other branches. Uh -huh in various parts of Trinidad. I know persons who say, well, why do you have a first place in Spain? Why do you have a place in Rima? Why do you have a place here? Why do you have a place there? It takes money. It takes investors. It takes people with the gumption. I don't want to be running all these stores. I want to make appearances there. I want to do what is necessary to make sure the stores are successful. So I am not going to stretch myself so thin that I cannot manage everything. That's why I'm a franchise store. Persons own the store, part with me, and we do everything so you don't make profit overnight in a business but you can start the ball and you can hit the ground running with the other um, dr Raj Adal boutique because it is a business that brings in a lot of customers and it, it is a unique type of business at the end of the day we are going to have about 10 and two outside of Trinidad, which is tobago and that's it. we're going to cover the entire island but the main thing is dealing with the issues of the individuals who want help for their sexual dysfunction. That is the most important thing. Just as we talk about it on the radio here and try to assist people out on the radio, we're doing that at the clinic also. Beautiful. And you're still taking on Karen from five minutes past six, seven o'clock. Thanks for being here. Thanks for the power to point to the thing. Rick, thanks for all this. Stop the ride. Run it up. Once again, my team at home, as we can be here at Community Scott, two things for us, stay clean and go green. Avoid the one-use wrapping item for breakfast and lunch. Instead of clean wrap for cake sandwiches in the morning, get uh, the catered sandwich container or use the Ziploc bag every day. So before you use things once without thought, reuse tea points for clean, Jesus Trinidad and Tobago. Powered by Slim Coils, the Trinidad and Tobago Solid Waste. Management Company Limited, Power 102 and the Boom 94. In association with Tower and Horses, they provide first supermarket, Trinidad and Tobago Police, Union, Wish Market, GT, and the Guinea Group of Companies. So, folks, at home, at work, and in your community, think twice, think clean, and go green. Do you need to get work done on your vehicle? Look no further than the Auto Champion. Auto Services, from vehicle inspection to shutdown service, they do it all. Champlain Auto Services, with mechanics and technicians, exceptional customer service, with accessories galore. Champlain Auto Services is your one-stop shop. They are your auto champion. You name it, they can fix it. Champlain Auto Services, East Main Road, opposite Paris. Call 662-6545 and like us on Facebook. Champlain Auto Services, we do it all. Before you ask, Think twice. Think twice.
A vám ještě pán. Stáně. Na to ty ty Hi, good evening. No, it's called penis, penis papules. It will not cause an infection to a woman, and it's caused because of the testosterone level in the individual. Um, sometimes it goes away naturally, and sometimes it needs treatment to go away. And also, um, if a woman has an infection, if a man won't want to experience it, it will not open my door. If you make a contribution, um, order it, if it's going on, what's not, I will call it. If a man, what? Are they, are, uh, sorry, if a woman, what? If, um, a woman has an infection, if a man won't want to Overnight it will not overnight will not cause a problem, but yes, for a couple of days and whatnot could because you can have bacterial um, bacteria developing, which will cause a problem. So you have to be careful about that. You have to um, hygiene goes with intercourse, just as how you should never touch a woman's vagina or a woman shouldn't touch your your penis with a dirty hand. Yeah. You can pass bacteria back and forth. I mean, simple little things. Money is a very dirty thing. Right? You know that. Oh, yes. Because money passes through Every many different day. hands, fall on the ground, you, you don't, don't know, know where money goes. has been. Holding money, transacting business, and doing anything sexual is a no-no. That's why you must have sanitary wipes, you must wash your hands with good old soap and water is the best, best way to do it. You don't need to use any other thing, hand sanitizers and whatnot, because some of it could be dangerous to your health. Good old soup and water is good enough to, for your personal hygiene when it comes to any sort of sexual play. Some women are very sensitive. So if you touch them with a dirty hand, you may cause them to get some sort of infection later on in their vagina or even on their breasts. Just as much as um, halitosis or bad breath could cause that also. There's some men who will get phimosis from that. If a woman gives a man a blowjob and she has halitosis, he could get phimosis from that. Mm. Bacterial infection could cause that. Of course, we treat phimosis. We're the only place in the Caribbean, I think the only place in the world that treats phimosis without a person having to do surgery. Mm. But men who have phimosis, they know how painful that could be. And we treat it at the adult therapy center. We treat it at the adult 
Heritage Center, every single day we have somebody coming with phimosis. And I must, I'm very proud to say my wife came up with the solution for phimosis. She did her research. She got all the things that need, we needed to get. She put it together, and well, they, 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 they swear by it. Mm -hmm. I have people from overseas who will write to me and say, I have this, I, I'm wondering if to do surgery, and I said, no, you don't need to do surgery. You don't need to do circumcision. We have the cure. Some persons are cured overnight. There's one guy who came to me. He has been to doctors um, all over Trinidad. Until a doctor in San Fernando told him, you have to go by Dr. Raj, a medical doctor. I'm not a medical doctor. I'm a PhD doctor, right? No. He's a medical doctor. And he came by me for treatment. And he told the guy, that the only person who could help you is go to Dr. Raj. So he came by me. And he was in tears. This, this man was in tears because he cannot have sex. He cannot masturbate. He cannot even urinate because when you have phimosis, it's that bad, you know. When you urinate, your penis burns so badly. The foreskin burns so badly. You will do anything to get out of that pain. So he told me, he said, you are my last resort before I go to get circumcision done. I said, you don't need circumcision. He said, that's what my doctor told me because my doctor sent me the I can't guarantee you what would happen, but you better try. The next day he called us, the next day after using what we call the cure. No. The next day he called the office and he was overjoyed. He said he has never been able, since he got phimosis, to handle his penis the way he's touching it now, even to urinate. He can't believe with one application. Of course, let me tell you something about it. Phimosis causes scar tissue. Scar tissue does not stretch. Now, if it don't stretch, what happens? Every time you get an erection or every time you try to pull back the foreskin, it tears. And it tears on the same spot so you have more scar tissue forming on top of scar tissue. In order to overcome that, we work from the inside out and from the outside in. The things that we tell you to do, we have the cure cream, we have the other cream that you have to apply, we have all we have the instructions to go once you start doing some persons will in the very first application, they can urinate without it burning. They're like, wait, where was this all the time? Some person may need a longer period, depending on the depth of the yeah. Now, what that what the treatment does is remove the scar tissue and cause the skin to become supple again. You can stretch it. So you don't have tears. Now, of course, if you don't do the full treatment, you will tear on the same spot because it's weak. You have to treat the skin from the inside and from the outside. It can take a month, two months, three months, up to six months to do it. But once you have done it, if you ever get it again, and like I said, let's say, for example, your partner has halitosis, your partner has, has dirty hands, she touches your penis, you get transferred to you, you get phimosis again, you may have tears on the very same part because remember, that was the weakest part of the skin. Mm. All you need to do is just do a follow-up treatment for a week and it's gone. Not it's gone. Not easy. That is easy. If you do the full treatment, you strengthen the skin in such a way that you never suffer from, her, from phimosis again. Mm -hmm. I have had men who, they were on the verge of going and do circumcision, which cost maybe anyway from five to $12,000, whatever they charge. And when they found out about the treatment for phimosis, they said, you are I said, yes, I'll give it a try. It doesn't cost as much. As a matter of fact, it costs you pennies on the dollars. As a matter of fact, it's the ten times what it costs you. Try it and see. This is the most important thing that you can do anyhow. I'm very proud of the fact that we have the treatment and the cure for females. This is one of the things that we have that we put in to sell to individuals who are out in the ego. So ship it out to them. Everything is all natural. They know there's nothing a pharmacist prescription, I mean, anything like that. It's all natural product. Is it Every, fair to say that it, it's herbal? All herbal. All, all herbal, herbal. All herbal. All herbal. Mm, so nice. you can ship it anywhere in the world. You don't need a special prescription. You don't need customers will never give you problems with it. Nothing. I've had persons as far off as Bangladesh sending for it. Mm. Well, of course, people know me through cricket. So yeah, you'll find that. Yeah, you don't do it bad, but you hit I don't bad. No, I don't want like that.
I love my cricket boy. <laughs> anyway, folks, taking your time, it's now 24 minutes before 8 o'clock. This explosion, right here on Power the 2.1 FM, with the only sexologist in the Caribbean, Dr. Raj Ramnanen of Total Image and the Adult Therapy Center. Well, I'll tell you what we are going to do. We're going to take a break and we'll be right back with you. Stay tuned. Are you the life of the party? Does your crew have the most vibes? Are you a karaoke singing champion? Then we got something for you. <coughs> Beyond Karaoke returns to Power 102. Join us as we visit Bars and Lounge in search of the best karaoke performers on the island. If you and your crew are the best, come sing and win with prizes for the best crew, the most entertaining performer. to announce us are coming to the sing and have a great time check out our power one to website facebook and instagram pages for more details beyond karaoke is on this and every thursday at a bar near you sponsored by carib carib it's the way we play valpa chinese restaurant the best fine dining in the east Lana, the best way to clean rich rock wheels little caesars extreme barbecue chicken pizza hearty food supermarket and nenix beauty services want to get your products and services out to more customers? How about getting more people into your store? Does your brand need a boost in exposure? Then radio advertising on Power 102 is the solution you've been looking for. With packages tailored to your needs and a team to create the ideal radio ad, the choice is clear. Power 102, empowering you. So call us today at 62 Power at 627-6937 and ask for an advisor about your ideas and brand. We are Power empowering you and your business today. We should estimate both local and international. Our economy has turned around and on a positive growth path. The government says the economy is on the rebound, but some business and professional leaders say there's no visible trickle down. In a Power 102 poll, the majority of respondents said they don't anticipate any real improvement in their quality of life. Next in focus, the state of the economy in light of the People are investing, they're spending money in this country. Credit has increased by seven billion dollars over the last three years. Has there been discernible growth in small businesses? How many jobs have been created? How many jobs have been lost? These are some of the questions we will be addressing when we go in focus. The state of the economy and its impact on our society in light of the midterm budget review. We will speak to the industry leaders, analysts, chambers of commerce, and before you act, think twice. Think twice. Think clean. Go green. For environmental awareness. Call 102 FM and Boom 94 FM continue to champion responsible action for life, safety, and now a cleaner environment. Our planet is what we made on. So let's make the right choices. The choice to reduce, to reuse, to recycle. To conserve, to preserve, to responsibly dispose, and to be more mindful of how we impact the world around us for this duration and those still to come. Join us for daily tips on how you can get involved at home, at work, and in your communities. Encourage your neighbors, colleagues, families well. Help change the culture and behavior for a greener, more environmentally conscious TNT. Think twice. Think twice. For environmental awareness. To you by Swimco, the Trinidad and Tobago Solid Waste Management Company Limited. Power 102 FM and Boom 94, in association with the Gillette Group of Companies. Bush Mountain TT, Salo Enterprises, the Trinidad and Tobago Police Credit Union, and the Price Club Supermarket. Think twice. Think twice. For a cleaner, greener Trinidad and Tobago. Explosion on Power 102. 
102.1 FM, your number one all around station when it comes to sex education. Show with the only psychologist in the Caribbean, Dr. Raj Ramanan of Total Image and the Adult Therapy Center. Don't forget the lines are open if you would love to interact with Dr. Raj at 222 8255. Also at 612-8255 for his private mobile if you would love to send a WhatsApp or text to messages. 740-1961. You can also send in your messages on our website at power102fm. Yeah. Question. If a man or woman or woman have multiple partners, is it possible for their body odor to change? Now, I like getting questions because what it does, it stimulates my mind. Mm -hmm. It also helps me to recall some of the things that person has been asked. Having multiple partners will not change your body odor. What changes your body odor is your diet, the type of foods that you eat, not interacting with people. As a matter of fact, you could be working with someone who has a very bad body odor. You will not pick up on that. It doesn't transfer. Body odor doesn't transfer. Body odor has to do with what you put into your system. Mm -hmm. So that's very important to note. Halitosis also has to do with your gut. How you treat your gut, what you do, your cleansing and all those things that you're supposed to do, what you call your flora and fauna inside of you. The flora has to be, sorry, flora, the flora has to be balanced within your system. So you have to know these things. You have to be careful of what you ingest because, what, I mean, if you ingest certain types of food over a period of time, you actually smell it in your sight. Right? For example, garlic. Yeah. Right? Onions. Does that. So you have these things. Don't just assume you have multiple partners or somebody have sex with me. It's going to change my body odor. It's not. You may get an infection and it's going to change the odor in your vagina or your penis. You may have a discharge, but it's going to change your body odor. And remember, your skin is your largest organ. Not sex organ. It's your largest organ. Your skin. The skin is an organ. From head to toe to underneath your feet, it's an organ that works. It breathes. It does a number of functions. How you treat your skin is an indication of your health. Some persons don't take care of their skin. They don't take care of their internal health. So it, it manifests itself on the skin. You never think that, eh? You'll ne because we take the skin for granted. We don't consider the skin as important, and, and this, is, this is very important to note. We do not think of the skin as important as the heart, the liver, the kidney, or the brain. But it is as important as any one of the internal organs, if not more important, because it protects the internal organs. Mm -hmm. So you have to take care of your skin. How are you, cuz? Let's see here. Marvin says, Dr. Raj, how do you treat pre-ejaculation and 43 can it be fixed? I hope you mean premature ejaculation because pre-ejaculation is different from premature ejaculation. Pre-ejaculation is what comes out of your penis before you have intercourse. Oh, okay. Right? Mm -hmm. Premature ejaculation mm -hmm. is ejaculating before your time, meaning you ejaculate before you satisfy yourself, satisfy your partner, and most men will tell you, well, I satisfy because I break. If you ejaculate quickly, you will not be satisfied because you feel you have shortchanged yourself. So how could you feel satisfied? If you, don't, if you don't satisfy your partner and you ejaculate, how could you feel satisfied? Whatever it takes for the satisfaction of your partner and then for yourself is what is needed to be done every time you have intercourse. Of course, there are times that your partner will want a quickie, you will want a quickie, and just because you're doing means that there is satisfaction in that. Satisfaction does not always have to do with a woman coming. And that's another thing. There are some women who are satisfied with a quickie, but not all the time. There are some women who are satisfied with their partner ejaculating quickly because they can time it and they can have an orgasm at that time also. But if he goes with someone else who don't know how to time it and takes 20 to 25 minutes to have an orgasm, he's going to fall short. There are some women who live with men who are minute men. Means they ejaculate very quickly. We call them minute men because it's within minutes they ejaculate. But they need a longer period of lovemaking, which is called foreplay. Mm -hmm. 
penetration and other things in the sexual act which lasts a period of time to bring the woman to that point where she can have an orgasm. Remember, we don't make a woman come, we help them to have an orgasm. And that's important to note also. And because that is more with a man, eh? We think that we make a woman come. Yeah. We don't make a woman come. We help them to have an orgasm. So we assess. We assess, yes. Mm. Anyway, folks, taking more time, 13 minutes before 8 o'clock, sex explosion, right here on PowerWFM, the number one all-around station when it comes to sex education with the only sex doctors in the Caribbean, Dr. Simon, of Total Imaging, the Adult Therapy Center, 2228255. Five, also at 612-8255. Those are the numbers you can interact with him live here in the studio. Yeah. Is he just asked a question to answer a question? Missing. Missing. Hmm. Okay. If you want to know something, it's missing. Yes, it's okay. missing. Okay. I'm just trying to put those puzzles. Yeah, you can't put that puzzle together. You could do what you want. You go up from here. Backwards to Toko and on a Friday, no, on a Friday, I can figure it out. Nah, not even on a Friday. No, you cannot figure that out. It's such a straightforward question. You, you see, you'll be thinking about all <laughs> kind of deviant things. No, it would And it's a straightforward right. question. Is it straightforward? Very straightforward. Yeah. It's missing, but you're going to find it. Yeah. Eventually. Well, but no, she you. wouldn't find it. You No, no, she wouldn't. No, it's not on the way up. No, it's after, 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 house. after they pass my house. I remember. Yeah, yes. But I have no intention of going there tonight. Things easy in the family. Oh, and oh, I last night we were doing what you call it. Yeah. Grand. Relaunch or singing career? Um, no, no, no. What, what, what do you mean relaunch? You mean relaunch? I sing. I sing but, already. No, no. Don't get tired. You know. I do record and I sing already. You know. I sang the big stage already, you know. I told you that Queen's to Hall. Queen's Hall. I sang Queen's Hall already. I didn't get invited to I didn't want to invite you because <laughs> you would be there pelted me. <laughs> that so. would do that. I would do that. Anyway, for the New York Times, 10 minutes before 8 o'clock, sex explosion on Power 102 FM. We're going to take a break and we'll be right back with you. Stay tuned. I just remembered that after years. Special estimates, both local and international. I said, just remember that after years. I don't know what I just popped in my head. The government says the economy is on the rebound, but some business and professional leaders say there's no visible trickle down. In a Power 102 poll, a majority of respondents said they don't anticipate any real. The doc is in the house, right? Jackie. Does the end of the economy, in light of the midterm budget review, do you believe the Trinidad and Tobago economy has turned corner? People are investing and they're spending money in this country. Has there been considerable growth for small businesses? How many jobs have been created? How many jobs have been lost? These are some of the questions we will be addressing when we go in focus. The state of the economy and its impact on our society. In light of the midterm budget review, we will speak with industry leaders, analysts, chambers of commerce, and before you act, think twice. Think twice. Think clean. Go green. For environmental awareness. Power 102 FM. And Boom 94 FM continue to champion responsible action for life, safety, and now a cleaner environment. Our planet is what we make of it, so let's make the right choices. The choice to reduce, to reuse, to recycle, to conserve, to preserve, to responsibly dispose, and to be more mindful of how we impact the world around us for this generation and those still to come. Join us daily tips on how you can get involved at home, at work. Encourage your neighbors, colleagues, family as well. Help change the culture and behaviors for a greener, more environmentally conscious TNT. 
Price. Well, by Brought to you by Swimco. Turn that into Solid Waste Management Company Limited. Power 102 FM and In association with the Killer Group of Companies. Bush Mountain TT. Solid Enterprises. Turn that into Tobago Police Credit Union. And the Price Club Supermarket. For a cleaner, greener, credit debt in Tobago. Tell you that nobody does better what we do best when it comes to sex education right here on Power 2 FM with the sexologist Dr. Raj Ramadan of Total Imaging, the adult therapy center. 2228255, also at 6128255. You've got a couple minutes. Yeah. For those of you who join us late, we will ha have a, a program until 8 o'clock. After that is karaoke. So, yeah. We apologize for that. Sex Prison is only on from 7 till 8 on a Thursday now until Saturday is done. Uh, Mary says she's watching. She's still in New York. So she's watching from New York. Mary. Your, your friend Mary. Your friend Mary yeah. from Belmont. She asked me a question the other day and about some track and I couldn't get it. Mary, well, I do track. apologize. It was a sex question. I no. want to know about track. No, no. No, but she was tracking. She was tracking, yeah. Hi, yeah. Renuka. How are you? So, um, where were we? We were talking about the different things that you can do. And the guy said, it is premature ejaculation. And I explained what premature ejaculation is. And he says we have persons who last very long and cannot ejaculate. So, um, also something you have to look at. Both of them. Yeah. The here so fine. Squinty eyes. And this person is from Whitman. Hi, good evening, guys. Great program as usual. Dr. Raj, I was told by a friend that there are natural causes for herpes. And two, are you aware of any that can, can they get rid of you? Can be gotten rid of your body totally? Or is this an, um, is this an ST? Meaning you can get herpes from touching, mm -hmm. you can get herpes from oral sex, you can get herpes from um, using the same underwear as someone who has herpes. So it's transferable by air because it's a virus that is, that is airborne. Uh -huh. It is one of the foxes. And it is treatable. As a matter of fact, we have the treatment at the Adult Therapy Center. Um, at one time it was touted as, there are research that was done Mm -hmm. But they just they have got they have finally gotten um, they have finally gotten approval from the FDA to get an FDA number, but they cannot they cannot advertise it as the cure for herpes yet. Oh, okay. But it puts the herpes in remission. It's um, something that we do get at the adult therapy. We used to carry it, but the foreign exchange problem and whatnot, we don't. So um, yes. It is something that is treatable. Mm, it is. Yes, very. Oh true. well, I now ex um, I now expand the reading, and um, I'm going to read that again for you. Hi, good night, guys. Great program as usual, Doctor Raj. I was told by a friend that there are natural cures for herpes one and two. Are you aware of they rid of the body totally? Well, I don't know about natural cures because I know persons have tried all kind of things for for it, but I know there is. The adult therapy okay. center for so I can't tell you any um, natural cures. No, mm -hmm. there's nothing that I've come across mm -hmm. in all the years of research and dealing with those things. There's nothing that I came across that would cure herpes naturally, or there's a natural cure for herpes. Mm -hmm. Absolutely not. Yeah. So this, it is something that you have to live with, basically. No, remember next week Thursday is a public holiday. We will not have food. Y yes. Indian arrival day. Yeah, Indian arrival day. So. We have to remind the listeners of that also. Yes. So. So you still got a couple of minutes in which you can interact we do. with Dr. Rajiv. We've got about five, exactly five minutes. Um, give Dr. Rajiv a call right now in studio. 
612-8255, also at 612-8255. Instrument I have here for, for clarification, um, but unfortunately, I think it was muffled, and I hope you're getting a better sound now. Mm -hmm. I have to move it again. Oh, you have to shift around. Shift around, put it in the right place, as as usual. Mm -hmm. But it's, I mean, finding the right spot for it. Yeah, but that should be fun, even though we don't have much more time. But to find the right spot. At least we will know where to put it tomorrow. <laughs> And in case you're wondering, tomorrow we do have um, sex exclusion from yes, 9 right. till 11. So we're on tomorrow. Yeah. And the information is important, huh? Eh? Information for? Sex education. You know, we've been hammering on that for quite some time. Mm hmm Still can't uh, come to terms, you know, that it hasn't been introduced in school at some level. Sex education? Yeah. I think when you use the word sex education, that becomes a problem. Um, adult education. Mm -hmm. some, some other word, but you don't use the word sex education. Um, you see, the thing about it eh, is when you mention, and I'm pretty sure people in the arms can see, when you mention the word sex education, now, people think in terms of primary schools, and even, I think they're thinking on a higher level, secondary, when you reach that age. What? Secondary school, rather than... Well, I will tell you something as a sexologist, and any sexologist will tell you that anybody who studies sex and whatnot, it is important in the formative years of a child to tell the child the truth, mm -hmm. and that is sex education. Yeah. When you start telling children stupid things, like, you know, concerning how they came about and what not. You are looking for problems later on because sometimes the child will say, well, they don't know what sex is. Or? Yeah. They already know. Yes. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. But they don't want details and this is where people get tired. Now, some persons will say, well, leave it up to the, the parents to teach their children about sex. But if the parents don't know, what are they going to teach their children? It's like telling a parent to teach their children um, at maths. And I teach the parents who don't know nothing about arithmetic. You think they're going to teach them math? Well, well, right. It's the same thing. You need a professional. You need someone in the, who has the, um, the wherewithal to do it. Well, I mean, I, the clock on the wall is like Cinderella. You know, she got her... It is she, ticking away. <laughs> she got her... Um, so with that, folks, we have a program that cute to wrap up. Junior wants me to wrap up tonight no, early because he um, has karaoke. Yeah, I hope he don't sing for you all because. No, I don't know. I'm, you're going to make a party. I'm going to get a piano. What are you going to sing? 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 Are you going to No, no, no. <laughs> Good afternoon, Alex. You have to listen to Pink Lady and Tommy and Pink Lady. You have to listen to Pink Lady and Tommy and Pink Lady. You have to listen to Pink Lady and Tommy and Pink Lady. You have to listen to Pink Lady and Tommy and Pink Lady. You have to listen to Pink Lady and Tommy and Pink Lady. Routine, it is that the industry, and um, for those of you who don't connect, Dr. Raj will be back here with us tomorrow from 9 mm -hmm. on a Sunday, Thanks, Coming up next.